Right out of college, we got drafted to play professional baseball. Um, I, I quit voluntarily in double-A. He got ousted because he couldn't hit a curveball. There you go. So we didn't have a clue what we were going to do. We earned our real estate licenses. Ten years later, in uh, 2012, we had 100 offices across the nation. Wow. And HGTV and several other networks found us and wanted to do a reality show on us. So it was five networks originally. Wow. Okay. It narrowed down to two of them in the spring of 2013. We chose HGTV. And uh, you know, they're a smart network, so wah, they, wah, wah. they vetted us. <laughs> no. They vetted us. They did a good job, and uh, they found a few things that uh, my brother David had said. His mouth is always getting me in trouble. <laughs> I'm the innocent guy, usually. And uh, at a prayer service that we had hosted with about 9,000 Christians the night before the Democratic National Convention in Charlotte, North Carolina. And... Uh, in that time, my brother spoke uh, on 1 Corinthians 6, 9. Okay. And so we, we talked with HG about this, about our stance on pro-family, what we believed about that, that we were Christian guys, we loved our wives, and, uh, and so we were adamant that we were pro-family guys, and they said, hey, no problem, we're with you guys, we know that you don't hate anybody. And so six months later, um, when we were five weeks into filming a guaranteed to series, six uh, full one-hour episodes, they announced our show at the Upfronts in New York City. Okay. This was in April of just this year, and uh, a, a group named GLAD wasn't too excited about that and uh, told HG, essentially, you need to get rid of these guys. And so HG bowed to the pressure and called David and I and said we had to part ways. So that, that was the end of it, and that's the last time we've talked to him. Okay, so what 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 did you what you say? What you do? I mean, I mean, <laughs> you, I, I mean. Well, I had to get David yeah. off the floor. He yeah. was bawling his eyes Jason, out with his little Jason pinky. Jason ran in his mouth. and was laying on the floor sucking his thumb. Yeah. And I said, "Listen, Jason, pick yourself up." Now, um, so j just so you'll know, I had spoken about all of the perversion in the church, all of the hypocrisy of Christians and how it's so easy for us to point at a political party that we would like to blame or other things for the fracture in our nation and the decline of morality. I said, but judgment begins in the house of the Lord. But I spoke about the homosexual agenda. I spoke about abortion and other things that we as a nation have okayed and said that it was okay, but God does not say that it's okay. So there was no ill intent in my heart toward any one individual group. Uh, but uh, so when HG called us, they said, listen, this was actually a week before they fired us. They called us and said, GLAD, which is the gay and lesbian anti-defamation or some type of a network, is not real happy. They found out through the grapevine uh, that you guys were going to be on our show. And they, HG was actually positioning us to be a, a pretty uh, major show. And we were going to premiere in October. Then when they announced our name uh, at the upfronts in New York City, then the right wing watch created a smear campaign. So what they did was they took some of my comments and grabbed some Westboro Baptist comments. I mean, grabbed some comments from wherever and created a narrative. And we didn't even know this. I got a text from our show executive that said, can you hop on a, on a call with uh, three other executives? And I told Jason, I was like, uh oh, I don't know what's going on because I hadn't even read this new article yet. Didn't even know it was out. I said, David's mouth's probably got me in trouble again. <laughs> yeah, sure enough. <laughs> so I had not said anything new. So uh, anyway, they said, listen, we're going to have to cancel the show. And, and instantly we said, you know what? We bless you. It's okay. Thank you for the opportunity. Wow.